so hello everyone in this question they are saying that a is a set of these numbers x y z p x is 0 right so so in a there is a matrix x which is vertical uh, or like 3 by 1 matrix x y z such that p x is 0 and x square plus y square plus z square is 1 so let's assume that x is like this small x small y small z where x square plus y square plus z square is 1 now p x is 0 so let's say p is so p is given 1 2 1 minus 2 3 minus 4 and 1 9 minus 1 right now p into x so this is 3 by 3 and this is 3 by 1 matrix equal to 0 matrix so we'll get 3 by 1 only 0 0 0 so if I multiply them I'll get x plus 2y plus z that will be equal to 0 then row by column uh, minus 2x plus 3y minus 4z equal to 0 and then x minus plus 9y minus z equal to 0 these three equations I am getting right now if you observe this uh, value of this determinant p determinant of p is 0 right determinant of p is 0 so I can say that there will be infinite solutions because d1 d2 d3 are already 0 because coefficients are 0 here so determinant is also 0 so infinite solutions will be there let's try to solve these equations so if I add 1 and 3 if I add first and third I'll get 2x plus 11 by equal to 0 so I can say x will be minus 11 by 2y right if I multiply by 4 in the first equation and if I add in or if I multiply by 2 in first equation and if I add in the second equation what will I get 7y right minus 2z equal to 0 I got y equal to or I can say z equal to 7 by 2 so um, I got L minus 11 by 2 by as x y as y and z as 7 by 2 now we know that x square plus y square plus z square is 1 they have given x square plus y square plus z square equal to 1 so from here I will get y square as how much 4 upon 121 plus 49 plus 1 right so that is 4 upon how much 171 we'll get two values of y 2 upon root 171 and minus 2 upon root 171 so i'm getting two values of y similarly i'll get two values of x and two values of z so we'll get two solutions of x y and z so there will be exactly two solutions option b is option 2 is correct right i hope you have got it 